Hello, and I am like here. We are in Los Angeles, right near LAX, Los Angeles International Airport, or a 15 minutes drive. We're at a German village. I have my German boyfriend behind the camera, the Hello. iPhone. And I wanted to come here because right over there is a grocery store that's apparently German themed. So we're gonna go check that out. But I wanted to see what my boyfriend thought of the German village. And do you feel at home? <laughs> no, I don't want to call this German village. It's barbarian village. I know, a I was gonna say village. that. But it's also because they have a big place for Oktoberfest here, so they're really focused on Oktoberfest. Mm. I think this is the biggest stereotype that Americans think of Germany. They think of Bavaria as Germany, and I had to learn that when I was living in northern Germany mm. when I studied in Hamburg. Um, my boyfriend's from Hamburg, so he probably is used to that. Every American you talk to, they say, Oh, have you been to Oktoberfest? Yeah. And I wasn't, so... <laughs> And you've never been there? I've never been to, yeah. I talked to a co-worker today and he was really surprised about this. I think it's it's funny because whenever I ask Germans from the north if they've been to Oktoberfest, they almost have this hostility about it. Like, they don't like it. They don't like the sound of it. And they're and annoyed it's that I'm... <laughs> because everyone thinks Oktoberfest is everywhere in Germany and yeah. Germany is Oktoberfest, so... So they must get annoyed. But I guess it's like when everyone assumes because I'm American that I vote for Trump or something. You probably uh, don't know geography. I don't want to come in this. <laughs> Let's go check out the grocery store. What are you hoping to find at the grocery store? Do you want to get in the shop? Uh, Lakritz. Lakritz! Yeah, Northern <laughs> this is what German. you don't like. The black <laughs> licorice. Really like Does this mean you like Jägermeister? Because it tastes like black licorice? Not anymore, but I think there are a lot of people in Germany that don't like Jägermeister anymore. Oh, Because right. I had too much. So you and had then a bad you don't experience. like it anymore. <laughs> right. That's like me and orange juice and vodka, oh, or yeah. as Germans say, vodka O. Yes. Right. In America. And you also have uh, vodka E. Vodka E. Vodka uh, with uh, energy. Oh, okay. Haven't heard of that one. What? It's an energy drink. Oh, it's an like energy drink. Like Red Bull. Oh yeah, we call them screwdrivers. Orange juice and vodka in America, it's mm. it's a screwdriver. Yes. What else do you want to find? La Kritz and then. So. I don't want to buy this now, but I think they should have German bread. German bread. Mm. German bread. I went to another store and they had nice things like German beer, like original German beer. Ah. And you know, there's one big one on your list that you miss. Mm. Coffee. Coffee, yeah, but this is not an... I can't buy you, it in a store. You, oh. Uh, maybe, maybe I can by the package. I know you've package, been very disappointed by every coffee oh, that yeah, you can yeah, buy here. Yeah, I think so, <laughs> they do something different. I don't know. I don't drink coffee. All I know every time I taste it, it tastes like yucky water, like dirty water. <laughs> um, so I'm curious when I go back to Germany, now that I know what it all tastes like, I've been tasting all your coffee that oh, you no. are not liking. So we'll see. I'll have yeah, to compare. But I'm pretty sure you don't like this in Germany. It's, well, I won't like it, but at least it I can... be too strong. I'll see what the difference is, at least, because I know because yeah. for me it's like yeah. Ugh. Yeah, yeah, so there it's probably it's like a big uh, <laughs> yeah, even maybe. bigger <laughs> I know you want donut kebab but we're not gonna find that oh no that's <laughs> it's kind of German but it's typical Turkish German yeah it's like Americans love our Mexican food so we're at Alpine Market Village and, and now I put the mask on <laughs> we're gonna go see what we find excited because I see muesli with fruit and I find that really hard to find usually. I love muesli with these fruit, dried fruit. With the banana, that's mm. fancy. You like these ones? It's really nice. I had this when I was small. It's cool. Oh. Lemon! Oh my gosh, I'm obsessed with lemon. Product of Austria. Okay. We don't know it else. No, it's okay. No, it's good. So you can take it. Okay, I'll take it. <laughs> <laughs> I miss mayonnaise in a tube. It's so much no, more convenient. Ma mayonnaise. Oh, okay. Yeah. What were you saying? Zen? Zen. That's mustard. Yeah. Süßer Zen. I remember these from <laughs> Oldenburg this and fun, this, Hamburg. Do you know what this means? What this could be? Red white? Yeah. Oh my god, it's ew. You it's know? ketchup and mayonnaise. Yes. I do not like that. You also can say Pommes Schranke. Pommes Schranke? 
Sanke? Yes, gate, like the gate. Oh. And because it's white and red, yeah. everyone knows that this means you want to hold rice. Ah, cool. Curry sauce, Germans love their curry sauce. Hmm. Oh, I like this one too. Krabla. Mm -hmm. Garlic. Okay. Do you like this? What is it? Rotkohl. It's okay, uh, not my favorite. But... Marzipan! I love marzipan! I want some. It's this one. I think I'll try this one. This is so nice. Yeah. So delicious. I thought it was okay. <laughs> I like these ones. Full corn. Yeah, but it don't, it's Oh my god, cool. that's rock yeah. hard. I think it's. Oh my god. Six grain. Okay, that's a little squishier. That sounds good. Six grain. But I don't want to trust I don't trust this because this is really hard and this is not normal, so maybe it's poor. Let's see what the date says. It doesn't have when it's good until. Mm. That's not good. And now you can see what the Americans do with German traditions. Make it sweet. They make it sweet. Sweet pretzels. Oh my gosh. Have you ever had um, plastic eyes? Some kind of one? No. I've seen them. Oh. It just my American taste buds would go for something squishy, not crunchy. Ah, oh, it's crunchy but it's sweet, so. Okay. Martipan slices. That mm. sounds good. Martipan potato? Nice. <laughs> the, yeah, what about this, huh? Yeah. In my cooking class in Hamburg, we made a black mm -hmm. forest cake. So complicated. It was so hard. Yeah. The beer. Oh. Probably a lot of Bavarian beers. So, what's your favorite beer, and do you think you'll find it here? Mm, uh, looks like no, I think I don't think so because it's coming from Hamburg. It's a small. Um, you don't think they'll have Astra? Oh no. Oh, there's Yefa. Yefa comes from a tiny town near Oldenburg where I was studying. But it's quite popular in Germany. So. Oh, it is? Yeah, yeah. Oh. I mean, it's uh, Ratsherrn, it's this more. Hmm. So I don't like Weizen, so I think um, you like it or you don't like it. It's um, some, nothing between this. Imported wines. Is there a German wine that you yeah, know? Riesling, I remember Riesling, that. Yeah. Glühwein! Yeah, Austria, yeah. My favorite Glühwein! Oh my god, I think I'll buy one of these because I just love glue vines Ooh, so much. So I would pay on two euros. <laughs> two euros? For one bottle. Oh my god. That's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> you guys love your um, vitamin juice stuff. Uh, yeah, I yeah, I think it, they, they just made a lot of uh, commercials. And you make it, sa it makes it seem like you're drinking vitamins. I have, I did not like them. Yeah. Crunchy covered that are, peanuts. That we are here with two cats. This looks good. The mixture. Hmm. Your paprika chips. <laughs> Ger Germans and their paprika flavored everything. For five dollars? No. <laughs> I would pay, I don't know. I maybe know. One, one, one euro, euro something yeah. usually. I remember that. And it's not that expensive. Hi. So I think it would be, oh no, maybe. This is your favorite? Okay, we have to buy some because I want to see what it tastes like. I don't want to wait until I'm in Germany. Mm -hmm. So this is, I think, uh, I'm not sure if it, this one is a good one. But Grandpa really? is drinking this. Really? Oh. Oh, intensity. There's three beans. I feel like you would like the five bean, right? Made in Germany, though. Oh, I never understood these things. Like, how the heck do you make... Soup in a bag. I never no, understood. No, no, no. So it's spices for something. Spices? Yeah, and you have to do a lot, like kind of cooking, and you just mix it with the kopsana and kopsana is not milk. Cream? Cream. Yeah, with cream. So you mix this, and then you have yeah, it's just spices, and it tells you what you have to do and what you need, like noodles and oh, ching. That's what I, I was saying. I tried to make this oh, by itself. Oh no, you have to <laughs> buy all the ingredients and then there's also, I oh know this is an explanation what you have to do. 
Is this in English or German? Oh, they, they made a new label in English. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How funny. Oh no, there, cooking and instructions. Oh my god. So this is how an we English do it. An English one. I'm so spoiled to see this. I will... You know, should I get one? Oh, these are not $4. Four dollars. <gasps> they were so cheap in Germany. Yeah, yeah. Wow. What are these things? Bavarian or also mm, in the north? No, like... Uh, say it. Uh, sechs Semmel Knödel. Oh. Yeah. It's good, thing. Yeah. Im Kochbeutel. Yeah. And this is what you can eat with uh, Rotkohl, for example, and then some meat. It looks easy to make, you just mm -hmm. boil it, that's it? Yeah. Okay, I think I'm gonna try it. <laughs> so it, should be, it would be really good with uh, Bratensauce. Bratensauce? Wait, um, on the potatoes? Yes. Oh. Uh, so, because you, you eat this with uh, Braten. So the meat. Uh, roast! There we go. Roast roast beef. Hmm. Okay, this. So you would eat this with the klöße and rotkohl. Okay, I mean I'm not really a cook, but maybe Daniel can help. Oh, no, no. Don't do this. What? Oh no, bad idea. Oh, because of the price. Pomis! Pomis seasoning! Oh no. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. Haribo, oh my god. Yes. These look so good. There's your black licorice. Yeah. Do you like this yeah. one? I like this one. Colorado. So it's a mix of everything. Colorado. Mm. $4. Mm -hmm. I'll, I'll try this one. We can make a video and of, I like of this trying all of this. Because it's liquid, so. You like your black licorice? Yes. I know in Germany what I was looking for was always the sour... Wow. Mm. But it's not common. I never found sour candy in Germany. Oh, we have some, but not that many. I think. Like, I'm surprised to see this. Have you seen that before? Mm, not this from Hawaii, though. All the green frogs are good, too. That's sour! Okay. Another sour. Weird. What's your favorite German chocolate? The, the Sweden one. Swedish? Oh. Yes. yes. Because they are liquid inside. <laughs> it's li oh, there's liquid? Yeah. Yeah, I recognize these all from... Germany. I don't know why I like this Katzenzum. <laughs> it's just chocolate. Katzenz. I've never seen that before. That's cute. Cornflakes. Cornflakes? Yeah, so what? it's crunchy. Inside. You so. guys put cereal in your chocolate? Yeah. Why? Because it tastes good. <laughs> <laughs> That's strange. I dark chocolate. Uh, but I think it's not that strong. It tastes quite good. I like it. And I don't like dark chocolate. Oh, really? Okay. So. It's like a mild dark chocolate. Oh my gosh, I've been looking for blackberry jam for years. Do you have a favorite muesli here? Yeah. Chocolate muesli? That sounds like dessert. So I don't like chocolate in my muesli, so maybe, maybe some of these. No sugar? No, so sugar. With sugar. Yeah. Okay. And then here's those confusing baking powder things. Like I was trying to find baking yeah. soda when I was taking that cooking class yeah. and then I found out you guys don't have baking soda. So this is back for... Uh, oh no, it's English. Okay. Is it Rockers? Rockers in a can? It's already cooked. It have you seen it? No. I never have never seen this before. You've never seen that? No. That's Ooh, strange. What? Ew, sauerkraut. Meat salad, that sounds so gross. The Dickman? Yeah, yeah, this Dickman, Dickman is good. I think it's the brand. Oh. What is it? A marshmallow? No, it's softer than a marshmallow. Oh. What is that? A liver horse? I, I don't know oh. how it works. Oh. We're trying the coarse liver horse. Uh, beer thing. Beer thing thing. Yeah. Uh, 10 slices. Also got one of these wieners. And mortadella. And mortadella. Oh, we're gonna get that next, right? What is mortadella? I don't know. Who uses this? <laughs> I don't know. You, why can you eat it now and you don't have to cook it? Or? You can just heat it up, but you don't have to. Really? Yeah. Huh. 
I feel like Americans wouldn't know that. And you don't put it on that. Really? Mm -hmm. Tastes good. Mm. Comparable to German? Yeah, it's. I would say it's the same. Mm. What are these called in German again? Wiener Würstchen. Because they're little. And they call it here Wieners, so that's a short version of this. <laughs> mm. But when it's hot, tastes much it better. Tastes I guess. better, but it's good. So. Do you eat it with a hot dog and ketchup? Mm, you can. I would eat this with. Uh, how do you say? It? Mustard. It's pretty good. I told you. It's got some <laughs> spices. Mm -hmm. I'm surprised I never thought of biting into a hot dog before that wasn't it's cooked. Not <laughs> it's not a hot dog. <laughs> Worst. What's the difference Sausage. between this and a hot dog? I don't know. It's got little red dots. Mm -hmm. Is that spices? So spices, yeah. So it's good? Mm -hmm. I'm so hungry, so. Yeah, it's good stuff. No idea why they call this beer shinken. Yeah. It's made with beer. I don't know. I, mean, I don't know what it says. Ta da! I don't usually like ham, so I'm scared. Hmm, tastes like fat, fatty. Well, it's mm -hmm. a, a little bit, yeah. But it doesn't have the chewiness, which I hate. I hate that. So mm. it's nice. It doesn't have that. What do you think of it? Mm, I like it. The same what I get in Germany. Really? Like it in Germany. Yeah. Mm. I've never had meat from a. a I never bought. So I would say schlachter, but. That's when they prepare the meat in the back side. Hmm. Here, fleisch take the key that too. Oh wait, it doesn't taste like beer. So. No, no. <laughs> no beer <laughs> in there. No. I don't know. Maybe. Maybe. Mortadella. Not sure how many grams it is, but it's kind of expensive. Is it? Oh. Yeah, it's five slices. Five slices. Yeah. And again, I don't know what it is, but I like it. It's got white spots in it. Mm -hmm. It's good. I had better ones, but it's good, yeah. Weird. It's different. A little bit slimy. It's like spalony, kind of. You like it? Interesting texture. I don't think I like it. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like it. <laughs> okay. It's got a funny aftertaste. Mm. Mm. I think the aftertaste is that what I don't like from these ones. Oh, how do you say Le it? Lieber. Lieber. Wurst. Wurst. Mm -hmm. I see, and this is a, like, they're a tiny, thick things in there. Yeah. This is why it's grobe Leberwurst. Oh, it's the thick one. Yeah. How do you say it in German? Grobe. Grobe? Grobe, yeah. Leberwurst. Grobe Leberwurst. That's good. That's good. That's a good one. What you, do you won't like it. I won't like it. Hmm. I think on bread it tastes would be a little bit better on bread. Mm. It's cream. <laughs> Ew. That's <laughs> nice. It's meat cream. <laughs> yeah. What? <laughs> I didn't expect that. <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm so surprised. I was expecting something more like dry and it's like wet. More dry. What do you think? Do you like it? I've just never experienced wet meat cream before. <laughs> it's kind of like reminding me of tuna. Like you mm. can put tuna on a sandwich. This mm -hmm. is sort of what it reminds me of. But it's not tuna. It's meat. No fish. <laughs> Good? Mm. It's very strange. Yeah, I know. <laughs> but it could be strange for you. So you usually eat that on bread? Yeah. Oh, it could be also toast and bread. I don't know. Everything. Oh. I'm trying now the liverwurst on Brückchen. Brückchen. I just tried a little piece and it was much better than trying it alone for sure. I did have cheese and I had... Uh, what's this? Salami. Salami. So. So that's much nicer, but I much prefer it with the cheese on top of the liverwurst. 
and then the salami on top of the cheese. <laughs> and now it's perfect. <laughs> I much prefer the liverwurst just like this. <laughs> Yummy. What is your favorite meat? Comment down below. Meat on bread. That's, uh, I would be interested in this. So here we have the Jacob's Kronung. Just kidding. <laughs> Jacob's Jacob's Kronung. Um, coffee from Bremen. I didn't even know that till I read that today. It's Bremen from 1895. Wow. Awesome. Because your grandpa's from Bremen, right? Mm -hmm. That's how yeah. you know about this. He likes it. He likes it, yeah. I immediately can tell from all the coffee that we've been trying at the shops around here. Like we went to Phil's Coffee, which is very popular just like Starbucks. Um, and I've smelled your Starbucks coffee too, I think. Yeah, I always found the smell was bad. I didn't like it. But this one smells good. Is mm. it just me or does, does it smell different? No, it's the... not that strong, I think. Oh. Uh, is that why it's different? Because it's just less strong than the ones mm. I was smelling? No, maybe because it's a different brand. This is why, mm. what I searched for and didn't find here. So like, would you prefer this, because it's got three beans out of five, this like mild coffee? Mm. Would you prefer it to the stronger coffee you can get at the coffee shops here? No, I would prefer a German stronger coffee. I don't know why it's different, uh, but they do different. Well, for but me, it's I delicious. Would... I found my favorite coffee. Because, <laughs> well, this one, I mix it with a lot of rice milk mm -hmm. and a spoonful of sugar. It tastes so good. But yeah, here's the coffee. Just, I don't know, just a little taste. Like the pure, pure stuff. Yeah, it's less disgusting <laughs> as the other stuff. Like I could actually drink that without making a weird face, I think. But maybe it's because it's the three beans and not five. Mm, maybe it's just because yeah. it's low intensity. Mine, mm, with all the sugar. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, when you tasted this, what did you think when you tasted my version? That um, you don't have coffee in there. Mm. Yeah, tastes like sweet water that makes you hyper. Mm -hmm. Sweet milk. Okay, so we just got done shopping. We're, we're gonna make another video where I will trying all this stuff. And um, maybe you'll join me too, I don't know, we'll see. But what did you think of the German grocery store here? Really expensive, but they had a lot of stuff. Uh, known from Germany so really nice and yeah and it was written in German so they got it from Germany and didn't produce it here so you were impressed yeah, I was impressed of the prices so I paid for a six pack beer I think it was Bitburger that was I think normal beer they had 15 euros you got a six pack? because the other ones were just Bavarian beer like Bites and other stuff. Yeah, so for so this six pack, I paid 15. I've never seen this bit burger. It's a big company. It's popular? Yeah. Where is it made? It's a bit book. Oh, it's, it's a, a, it's that's a, a city. city. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Where's bit book? Uh, southeast. Yeah, it's a small town under. Oh, okay, so it's also Bavarian? No, no, it's not Bavarian. Oh would be not my favorite but it was the only choice I had. <laughs> the only choice. What, what's the difference between the taste of northern beers and Bavarian? I don't know, maybe it's just a feeling. I don't know. You're happy you found your coffee, right? Yes, I was really happy. But sad you didn't find it sooner. <laughs> yes. Oh no. Really. I never thought about this, I forgot it. So we have a German village here. <laughs> yeah, I wish I thought of it sooner. I'd... I've been to that side of the village, just not this side with the grocery store. So I would have thought of it sooner too. And the bread? Yeah, the bread looks quite old, so I'm not sure if yeah. this would be a good choice. And they didn't have dates on it, which was weird. Yeah, yeah. But from my feel, because I feel bread, it's definitely hard. Like, yeah, not yeah. Like American I think it was bread. too hard. It's definitely too hard. Yeah. Alright, well, let me know what you guys think of the video down below. Were you surprised to see so many German things here? 